What's up, YouTube? So we just finished up at the Guidewell Center in Lake Nona, which is gorgeous. As you guys know, I am primarily in Lake Nona, so I'm a Lake Nona realtor. The new development here is very wellness focused. Like we have the Deepak Chopra yoga, meditation, all of that at the Performance Center. And then we have some really cool new innovations here. I mean, it's very tech heavy, very wellness focused. It's basically like a little slice of the west coast in orlando which i think is absolutely phenomenal and a lot of people are moving here for that reason so we finished a mastermind this morning um just got done talking to a couple people who were on my old team seeing how they were doing it's great to see people um that you haven't seen in a while so we're gonna gas up really quick we're gonna go get a car wash and then we're gonna go meet up with the team member and then i'm gonna take you guys on a new home tour i'm gonna be down in davenport today working on the Airbnb we just closed on. I'll see you guys soon. So this is the Ashton Woods model that we ended up going with for our Airbnb. This is the Laurel and this is the model home. So this is kind of like their showroom, very nicely decorated. I'm gonna take you guys through so that you can see exactly how nice these townhomes are. Again, this is Davenport. These are short-term and long-term rentals which means you can live in these or you can rent them out if you wanted to do Airbnb, Verbo, or any other short-term rental. So these are in the heart of Davenport. They're in a community called Champions Gate, which is developing really nicely. Um, lots of restaurants, lots of things to do, close by everything. And these particular townhomes are right off of the four. So if you know anything about Orlando, you've probably been on you're probably familiar with the four. It goes to Disney and to the parks. So most people who've been to Orlando have had to drive on the four. Um, they are doing some road work here in Orlando to make it a little easier to get around since we've had such an explosion and so many people moving to Orlando. They really want to keep up with the growth of this city by expanding the roadways, which is awesome. So hopefully we will have less traffic in the upcoming years as they continue to navigate the roads. So these homes in Champions Gate are located 6.8 miles from Disney via the I-4. So it just depends on the time of day that you leave, but traffic can be anywhere from 13 minutes all the way to, I've had it one time you guys be an hour. So it just depends um, on traffic. I often joke that sometimes the traffic here is getting as bad as LA. Newsflash, it's not, I'm just being dramatic. But anyways, um, this is the community, super active community too. Like people are always running and biking. It's just a great little area. Um, so Champions Gate, a couple more things about it. If you're thinking about moving to this area, there is a lot to do. I'm going to tell you guys the different restaurants that are in the area. So it is expanding. It is growing. Um, but we're going to go ahead and we're going to take a look at the restaurants as well. So there is the Four Corners Tavern, First Watch, an Italian Kitchen. There is a Publix, a Magus. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, but Huey Magus Chicken Tenders. You have Miller's Ale House. You have Blue Coast Asian Cuisine. You have So Fresh. You have um, pizza, you have Tijuana Flats, Little Greek Fresh Kitchen, Tacos Don Andres, McDonald's, Subway, Chili's, and kind of like the, you know, Wendy's and other fast foods. You have a Jersey Mike Subs and a lot of other restaurants. So lots to choose from while you are here. And there is a Longhorn Steakhouse right across the freeway. Some of the top things to do in Champions Gate are Walt Disney World, Magic Kingdom, you have Universal Studios, you have Animal Kingdom, SeaWorld, and Hollywood Studios, Epcot, Jewel Escape Rooms. You have Disney Springs, the Grand Floridian. You also have Disney's Typhoon Lagoon Water Park. Okay guys, so we are at Ashley Furniture right now. I'm picking out furniture for my Airbnb. So we decide on this couch, we have this table. We picked up pretty much every single bit of furniture from Ashley. I've used Ashley to furnish my other houses, so just figured it'd be easy. Um, this was the couch that I was gonna pick. It's so freaking comfortable, like unreal comfortable, but the other one's gonna look better aesthetically and you know, aesthetics matter in this day and age, but yeah, so this is the couch, kind of the living room set up, the vibe. All right, guys, it is the end of the night for me, so we are leaving Davenport. 
We are currently at the townhouse, just ordered furniture, comes at the end of the month and really excited. So we're gonna head home. <laughs>